Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jediah from Jediah's Room, and today we're finishing the second part of my closet. So let's get into it. Um, if you haven't watched the first part, go watch it. We're trying this new modesty thing so that, you know, we could serve God in a better way instead of just showing out all our goodies to the world. But yeah, let's get into the video. Hmm? We did this half last time. I'm not going to lie, I added this dress into there, and... Um, I'm not going to get rid of it. It's not technically modest, but I'm not going to get rid of it because I feel like I can layer it to make it cute and modest. So what we're going to do basically is we're just going to start going through that side of the closet. This is blues. There's a little bit of greens here, but this is blues, purples, grays, and blacks. So we only got like four colors on this side. So for the first piece, oh my gosh, honestly, I'm not getting rid of this. It's a, a tracksuit crop top skirt set and it's so cute. And I'm only not getting rid of it because I can wear it with like a, like an actual shirt underneath instead of having it like how I wore it the first time. This, it's a crop top like windbreaker. And I think we can keep this too because I feel like you can wear this with actual clothes. You know, like I just, the way how I was wearing it before was, I'm not going to lie, without no clothes. Oh, these we're not keeping because they're really short. Like, I'm not even going to try them on. I went to the club with this once. It's not meant to be club shorts. It's meant to be like... It's supposed to be fancy, but it gave club shorts, so I put it on with that that yellow mesh um, shirt I had. Obviously, this we're keeping. It says Waymaker, Miracle Worker, okay? Promise Keeper, Light in the Darkness. My God, that is who you are. If y'all know that song, you're goaded. This, I don't know if this fits me. We'll have to try this on. But honestly, do I want this? When have I ever worn this? What is this? Am I wearing it wrong? I might be. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Like I said in the first video, I don't be buying most of these clothes, okay? My grandma will shop for me and buy me things. They'd be like, oh, that's a nice blouse, mind you, without me even there. And so now I have this shirt that I've never worn. And this is how it looks. I'm not going to feel like a vampire. <laughs> I feel like a vampire. I want to suck your blood. <laughs> oh, no, it's tight fit. I really like this blouse. It's tight on the arms. It'll button up. But it's like, it's like really tight in this area, in the arm area. Because you know, like I said about the muscles. Look at that. Look at these muscles. <laughs> this one is that Tommy Hill figure. It's a blouse, but it's um sleeveless. Oh my gosh, this is. <laughs> okay, that's a no. Oh, I went to the baby shower just the other day. It's a short romper, and it kept rising up. It was like kind of short. I have to constantly pull it down. Oh my gosh, I haven't worn this in forever. I've had this dress since I was like 16. Not only do I think it does not fit me, it stretches. It's a nice dress. It might not fit. And even if it does fit, the whole back is lace. The thing with this is I wore this to church. I'm not even going to lie to you. I wore it with a tank top underneath, so it's not like... I feel like even with a tank top underneath, I should not have worn this to church. Probably not. The I want to know... Is this considered, I mean, I wear it like a cardigan. It's a nice dress. Now, it's a little tight without a cardigan. But good thing we have a cardigan. Like, honestly, like I said, if I wear the vest underneath, it'll cover that up. And it'll be like, thank you for coming to my husband's church. Nice to meet me. Pastor Jediah. Well, Prophet Jediah. Is he giving past his wife? Is he Thank you so much for coming to the church. We enjoy having you in our congregation. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Don't play with me. I have this Vera Wang blouse. Let's see if it fits. Yes, it's me, Vera Wang, the designer. Yes, you can have my autograph. You know what I think is crazy? I don't think Vera Wang would ever wear, or like any of these designers would ever wear their own brand. Like, when do you see Calvin Klein rocking Calvin Klein? Hmm. This is such a nice blouse though. This one isn't giving church wife, but it's giving church youth outing. Like, oh. yes, congregation, bring it in for the midnight prayer. <laughs> Honestly, I cannot wait to be a church wife. Like, I can wait because I can wait on marriage, but I cannot wait to be a church wife. Like, sorry, I'm getting emotional. I can't wait till the youth come to me and be like, Pastor, this is what we're struggling with. And can you pray for us? I'll be like, yes. And then just start laying hands on the youth. 
I can't wait. I can wait, but I can't wait. This was my 20th birthday dress. There's not much to it. Of this, at first, it's not giving modest at first, but thank God for a what? Fill in the word, fill in the word. A cardigan. Once you put a cardigan, you could turn something like really ugly. Look, like, look at this. This kind of just fits. This kind of just fits. I'll keep this one. I have three dress shirts. This one, I okay, this one is women's, I believe. This one, I think is men's. I'm not going to lie. It might be a men's dress shirt. But I always, I kept them because I told myself that I could transform this into something cute. This is a men's one too. I, let me show you. Let me show you. I'm going to be completely honest. I kept it because I was like, you could wear it open out with like jeans, right? So I don't know if I should still keep it because I don't know if I'll ever make that fit or if it was just an idea. I think we should give it away. Because <laughs> at this point, you're just hoarding clothes if you don't give this away. Like, when will you wear this? When have you ever worn this, Shania? And you've had it in your closet for how long now? Oh, okay. Mm. This is the woman's one. It's giving, I'm going to go get a job. This one fits. I just wanted to show you guys. I am fresh in my little fit. My little, my little, okay. Oh, okay. I look fresh, though. I don't even look like, what's up, mamas? I would talk myself up because that's just, it's giving like it's giving corporate fatty like it's giving it's giving <laughs> this is the second men's one and it's giving dr doofenshmirtz evil incorporated i got the glock in here <gasps> bang bang honestly i feel like listen <laughs> i'm not even gonna say that but all i'm saying is if i had to if i had to so now we're here this is my two-piece um cropped top set we're gonna get honestly we're gonna keep the shorts obviously we keep the shorts because we can sleep in the shorts or like beach in the shorts or something i don't know about beach but we go to something in the shorts not really the top seeing as how it's a crop top i mean what can we do with no jedi you literally can't don't keep this don't keep that we're giving all that stuff away so far i'm not even folding it up because i'm not gonna lie who got the time for that we got i got so many dress pants or pants in here that don't fit that i don't wear and i don't even want to try it on because one I tried this on the other day. It doesn't fit. So. <laughs> I'm not even gonna. This one too, I believe. I tried this one on too. But let me see. Should we try it on again? Should we try it on again? What size is this? See, the problem is not the size of the jeans. It's the size of my size. Oh! And God, thank you for my body. Because I'm grateful for it. But it's like... My pants don't think. All right. We're doing... I have so many hangers now, it's ridiculous. Like, take this door off. I'm going to be completely honest with you. It's kind of sad to see how many of my clothes are going because of, like, the nature of the clothing. I take the door off so you guys can see how many hangers... Before, I had no free hangers at all. Like, literally, if I had clothes that I, like, I bought and I didn't have a hanger, I would have to go take some from my brother's room or something. This doesn't fit. Join me in the next video as I try to replace all the clothes on these hangers. I just noticed don't even fit. This one is a large. Oh, wait, this is stretchy. This might fit. Let's see. I'm Like I said, I'm not taking my biker shorts off because it's like to the point that size where it's like kind of stuck to my body. This fits. It fits. It fits. Oh my gosh, guys. The first pair of pants that I tried on in any of the videos that fit. What is this? I hate trying on jeans, guys. I'm probably never going to try this on. I've had it for years and never worn it. What makes you think I'm going to wear it now? Because I rediscovered it in my closet. Yeah. What? Is there no? What do you mean? Oh, these sound like they fit. These fit. <gasps> you used to be my work jeans. I used to work in these. I used to... You're in my vlog. Sorry for dating y'all boys. All right, we finished blues. Wow, surprisingly. I only got like three blue clothes now. I'm going to need to go shopping. We might really go shopping, guys. Are we going shopping, Lord? This, I haven't worn this. And we won't be wearing it.
The thing is, I will lose my money over a good deal. Why I say that is because that dress was like $3. It doesn't even fit me. I picked it up. I was like, oh, $3. I would probably never wear these pants. Wait, they probably fit. They fit. Why don't I wear these pants? They're purple. Purple pants. You gotta color up your wardrobe a little bit. Like, this could fit though. We have so many clothes out already. I'm not gonna lie, that's like a lot of the closet. I'm gonna give this away or throw it away or give it away or whatever because I got it from my friend and I used to be so depressed and I used to just sit there put my hoodie on and like I used to be everywhere in this one hoodie and I'm not saying clothes hold spirits I mean, it could I don't know I'm not God it could I'm not gonna lie it probably could but just not the, not the type of clothes I want to be wearing like like, that's what I was saying about, like, having only dark clothes, and then, like, I used to only wear dark clothes. And then look at this. Look at this. This is a bodysuit. Look at the body. It fits. Don't get it wrong. It fits. It just... It's not modest. It's not of the Lord. Honestly, I feel like the first half of my closet is hurting me more than my second half. Because, like, I barely wear um, black clothes now. Like, I'm always in something colorful. jeans i got this dress the other day off poshmark really cute oh no it was trying to get away it was trying to get away but god said bring it to the light that's how he'd be doing to the demons look how short this i literally was wearing this the other day to make my prayer closet video and like my bra was showing on the underneath so look at this mountain of clothes you guys can't even see it for real. Oh my gosh. I got this super cute skirt set. Uh, <gasps> the infamous leather romper. That's not even a romper. This is like... <laughs> Look at the little shorts. <laughs> Let me show you all my trench coat. Yeah, bro, it's a little chilly outside. So I got my coat. I got my coat because it's a little chilly. Because it's a little chilly outside. Chile, you feel a little chile. This is actually a cute top, but it's a crop top. So, is it a crop top? Right, it's a crop top when you wear it. It's a freaking crop top. This skirt is too short, or like too tight. It's just very like. Should we try it on? Let's try it. Let's just flip it on over. Um, our shorts. Oh my god. It passes a finger test, but absolutely not. It's too short for comfort. Like, even with the fingers, like, shorts that are this short, okay, fine. But skirts that are this short, it's giving. It's not giving. That's it. It's not giving. Let's leave it at that. It's just not giving. So we're gonna give that away. This is a. It's a 
the bodysuit. I'm gonna give it away. Because even though it's like I could cover up my breasts and whatever, it's like still the style of clothing that's not glorifying to the Lord, you know. This is another dress. It's a mini dress. I'm sorry, the cardigan cannot save this one because look at this. And my teeth out. Realizing how much money I spent on these clothes, because I'm just like willy dilly like dashing, is why. This is a um a romper. I can exercise in this. It's not technically modest, but it's not not modest. I don't know how to explain it. Like, actually, am I keeping this? The whole back is out, but I can exercise in this. You know. Should I put this? It's like conviction, you know? You try to keep stuff because it's cute. This whole thing is going to open here. I think I can wear this with a vest underneath. I've never even worn this. Where did I think I was going in these clothes? Look at this. Let me try this on. Is this modest? What? It doesn't even fit. It's tight. And definitely not modest. It's like I know I should not keep this shirt. I know for a fact that this is not something glorifying God. But like, it's Fashion Nova. I've worn it like twice. <laughs> Conviction is one heck of a thing. Oh, this dress is cute. I'm keeping this dress. It's not revealing. It fits. It's a true religion tee. I see the one. You see that? That's not my god. And I'm not adorning idols. This is a blouse. This is good. This is a button up blouse. This is good. I don't know why I'm wearing it, but I'm going to keep that. This is a blouse dress top thing. I'm keeping that to wear that with leggings. What is this? I think this is a regular black polo tee. I got that from my brother. I think he's taking his clothes sometimes too. This is a skirt. This is one that I can wear. So basically, literally, guys, we have like three pieces of clothes left. This is a sweater I got from my mom. Um, this dress pants. These probably fit, but let me still test because I don't want to keep nothing that doesn't fit me or doesn't almost fit me. You know. This probably fits, but it probably fits tight. I don't want to keep it. Because <laughs> I've been needing dress pants for, like, when I go to court and stuff. And when I just, like, have meetings. This is a long um shirt that says, Social Distancing, Stay Away. I don't know if I should keep this. Giving anxiety. Something about this shirt just gives anxiety. <laughs> so, this is a skirt. I don't know if it fits. Like I said, I've had a lot of these clothes for a long time. Yeah, we'll keep this. And guys, we're done! We're done, we're done, we're done! We had a full closet, and we're literally down to this. Which is one, two, three sections. We got rid of so many clothes, guys. Look, we have all of this clothes. We have the clothes that we had from last time. Oh my gosh, is it giving renewal? <laughs> Let me show you guys. This is where we're at. Oh my gosh, I'm shocked. Look at the hangers. Look at the hangers. Alexa, light on. Go get you guys, go get you guys a smart light from um, Amazon. But look at that. Look at that. I could probably count the pieces of clothes in my closet. Before I couldn't. Like that is it. That is all my clothes right there. Oh my gosh. And then look at what I'm giving away. Getting rid of. Honestly, I'm just beyond excited that this is like what we're left with. I thought that I would be sad because like my clothes, like I love clothes. God, that's not true. I don't love clothes. I like clothes. I love the Lord. Okay, I like fashion. I like, you know, dressing up. Like, I like that stuff. So, I'm going to be completely honest. It's like, I thought I was going to be sad. But I feel so relieved. I feel rejoiced. 
I feel rejoiced. I'm gonna be completely honest. I feel very good about the whole closet clean out thing. Like, um, every piece, you know how proud I am to know that every piece of clothes in this closet is covering my body? Every piece of clothes, well, A, fits. I had a lot of clothes that didn't fit me. I just had clothes in there. God is amazing. God is amazing. But thank you guys for watching my video. Like, guys, we're doing it. We're almost at 200 subs. Ah! So, um, thank you for watching my video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video to a fellow Christian girlie. Ooh, yeah.